special favorite topic of shouts out and thumbs down. I'm going to go start it off. Uh, I'll give a shout out to the U.S. women's hockey team. They played their hearts out, but they unfortunately lost to Canada. So, shouts out to you. Can't believe y'all lost. I ain't giving you nothing. I ain't going to give you a thumbs down, but I ain't giving you a shout out. Well, I'm lying. I like it. Good, big ups to the USA team. I look pretty good. Hopefully the men can bring home the gold. It'd be nice. It'd be nice. But I'm going to give a thumbs down to Stephen Omari for not coming to this show when it was his idea to have a movie special topic. Oh, bro, bro really? <laughs> you get a thumbs down. I like to give a thumbs down to myself for not remembering Public Enemies, the Johnny Depp movie I was talking about last Sunday. <laughs> it's always nice to laugh at yourself sometimes. Yeah, I'm going to give a thumbs down to Mark McGuire's little brother for selling him up the river by writing a book on how he used performance enhancing drugs. Damn. I'm going to give a shout out to his brother because he says the stuff Mark left out. <laughs> Might as well tell the whole story if you're going to come out and I'm tell it. <laughs> I'm going to give a thumbs up to Mark McGuire for using steroids so he can hit that many home runs. Because I don't really care about the history of baseball. I just want to hit <coughs> home runs. Yeah, well, I suppose this way. I'll give a shout out to Mark McGuire for using steroids because because of him, baseball is relevant yet again. If it wouldn't have been for the summer 98, baseball would have been out. Possibly. All right, anyway, go ahead. I'm going to give a thumbs down to Barry Bonds just for being... Barry Bonds, a bitch, a punk bitch. I like to give a uh, thumbs down to the Rams for trying to trade their number one pick. To, uh, you, you know who they're trying to trade it to, right? I don't care who they're trying to trade it to. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. As long as they're just stupid enough to do it, you get a thumbs down. I'm going to give a shout out to Barry Bonds. I like Barry Bonds. I don't care what this knucklehead here say. We all have an opinion, but his opinion is wrong. Yeah, I said it. He struck out. I don't know how an opinion can be wrong, but his opinion is wrong. I plan and simple. <laughs> I like to give a uh, shout out to the Lumberjacks and Lady Jacks for winning last night. You know, Lumberjacks needed a win desperately against Texas State, and the guy actually got one. I can't believe I'm finna say this. I was on ESPN yesterday, and I was looking at schedules. And I, I completely forgot all about this. But y'all might not like this. I'm going to give a shout out to Sam Houston. They went to Kentucky and yeah. lost by 10. Yeah. I forgot all about that. I know yeah, they're all liable. Yep. They went to Kentucky. <coughs> they gave them, gave them all they can handle. Yeah. While Kentucky was, they was top, it was what, top uh, five? Man, they've, huh? been, they've been top five all season. You know, so they, I mean, just going to a top five team place and only lose by ten. I mean, I got to give a shout out to that. Yeah. Just, just being a true fan of basketball. Yeah, of college basketball, you got to be a fan. Uh, I'd like to give a uh, shout out to Michigan State, mainly because you now have a shot at beating Purdue. At first, I was, a little, I was a little scared on Sunday, but without Robbie Hummel, I think we have a shot. That's messed up. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it was not. I want to give a thumbs down to the man who got hit in the eye by a wiener. <laughs> what? Yeah, you didn't know that? You didn't hear about that? No. Oh, you need to watch the news. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> okay. The dude got hit in the eye by a wiener, by a mascot. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Okay, that. fine. Right, if, if you were, uh, since you uh, missed the game last night, man, do I give a shout out or a thumbs down for the girl who ran into the goal? She oh, ran, she man. ran into the pad. Oh, man, that was funny. All of her I give her a shout out just for getting up because I wasn't the guy. From that. They were quick to bring that crutch. Yeah, I'd like to give a shout out to the cheerleaders yesterday during halftime. Some of those stunts they pulled off were uh, pretty amazing. <laughs> Anytime you can throw a girl in the air with one arm and catch her with the same arm. A girl and no, just one arm. A girl through a girl? No. Oh, okay. It was dudes. <laughs> That's it, was it, was dude. <laughs> it was dudes throwing his one I mean, literally, he right. took it with his right hand, threw it in the air, 
caught her with his right hand. He probably was Jason. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably. But that was very damn impressive. I'm very impressed by that. Much more chilling than I thought they could really do. Yep. I want to give a shout out to the fans who became fans, which didn't make just sense what I said. But the people that are fans on Facebook of the range, I want to give a special shout out to you. We appreciate the love and continue to support us. Yeah, I want to give a shout out to the Grizzlies for actually being smart and sending Hashim the beat to the D League because he stinks. Yeah, yeah. He, he needs a little bit more time, but he get. He done. needed development. He, he shouldn't. He shouldn't have came out. He actually. Get done. Uh, I'd like to give a uh, like to give a shout out also to the new fans out there, but also the special guests that come on here for you know all the random ass topics that we do. We Some of them hold down. I can only think of two that I really enjoy being on here. Call them out. Arvin Nell and Justine. The only reason Justine, because she sits there and takes it all in. Give her a pen every now and again. But Arvin Nell, she just brings it. She don't hold back. She actually brings it. She's probably one of few that actually does. One of few, though. One of them. <laughs> I want to give a shout out to me. Because you know what? It's me, mother. Yeah, it's me. You right. Bleep, mother. Bleep me. <laughs> don't you forget it. Well, since they don't want to talk, I keep going. Oh, I thought he was still okay. going. I'm going to give a thumbs down to the man behind the camera. And this is the reason why. The man behind the camera, he don't know what the hell he want to do every day we come in here. One day we're going to talk about sports and then he change it up. Next day we're going to talk about this and then we go to sports. We don't know what the hell we're going to do. He even came up with his own itinerary but does not follow it. We discovered that the other day. <laughs> and to also, this man had the nerve to buy a round of drinks, shots, whatever you want to call it, for a young lady because she got her certification to become a teacher, which that's good and all. But you know what? What if she didn't get her certification? Would he have bought a round of drinks for the fellas? That's what I want to know. <coughs> See how he coughing? No, he wouldn't have. That's what he said right there. Y'all couldn't understand him. <coughs> yeah, I said it. He looking at me crazy right now, but I don't care. Yeah, I'd like to go ahead and give a thumbs down to the brother who left his boys last night. Not only to study for a test, but try to mack on a girl he wasn't going to get with anyway. Ooh, now see, that's what, see, that's going to get people punched because he's lying. So then, other words. Whoa, whoa, did you get it? I wasn't trying to mack. All right, then. I wasn't trying to mack. So that way you're talking outside your neck. So you stay at one of those business. You know, in other words, I did leave. I mean, I kind of felt bad for leaving my boys out. Yeah, but I was studying for a test. Two weeks in a row. Whatever. It's almost like somebody else would have. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to give a shout out uh, to the. Uh, <laughs> I'd like to give a shout out to the men's club basketball team going out to San Antonio this weekend playing in the tournament. They're going to hold me and wish y'all the best of luck. Appreciate Bring it. us something back. Let's put it that way. Let's just put it that way. And just bring something back. And don't get dunked on. Of course not. Dunk on somebody. Oh, just leave, just leave I still again. got a videotape of you shooting the basketball and you did not make one shot. When? Yeah. When? Yeah, you remember that. No, I hope you weren't talking about the half court I made some of those. No. Mm -mm. JB couldn't make a free throw to save North Carolina's life. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't matter. That was a fun day. That was fun. I didn't lose, I didn't lose money. Mm -hmm. I'd like to give a shot. <laughs> I'd like to give a thumbs down to the brother who just said he didn't lose no money. Because that's just cold. No, I'm talking about that night. I'm talking about that night time when she was bringing I didn't pay anybody any meals. Last but not least, I'd like to give a shout out to me. I woke up this morning and I measured myself. I noticed I grew three inches. Take that how you will. <laughs> On that note. I'd like to give a shout out. <laughs> That is really great, man. <laughs> I want to give a shout out to this weekend for the Purple Out basketball game. I can't wait to go. I like talking shit, and talking shit's what I do, and I can't wait to do a day in Corpus Christi this weekend. Three inches. This has been the range. That's the damn change. And we will see you next week. Take care.